Hey everyone, it's Dragon Fireflies. Oh, I wanted to show you guys the little wiggles. Yes, this one's very talkative. And I will pause the video and let them run around because that's why he's being, well, she, this one is being very, very whiny because they want out to play. So, okay, so they're all out and running around and playing. And this one, right here, oh, my flash is on. I'm sorry, I didn't realize that. But, like, we're pretty sure this one's a munchkin kitty because, like, the, the common trait is short legs and big eyes, and he has some really big eyes and some very short legs. If, he, I'll, if he'll let go of me, I'll let him walk around. You guys can see how tiny he is. This one's the runt. He's the last one born, and he's the most adorable. This one was the first one born. And, yes, they like to get into everything. As you can see, they knocked one of my little cauldrons over and spilled the sand. I should pick that up. <laughs> Um, but yeah, so I just wanted to update you guys on some things and then show you my litha altar. So, um, I'm just going to slightly shut this door for a second. Uh, I'll turn the light on to the kitty. To show you guys this. Hi. Sorry, my flash is on. I didn't realize that before I started filming. But, um, I got a tattoo for my birthday. So yeah, it's really freaking cool. I've had it for about a week. And yeah, it's all healed over. I absolutely love it. And then Zoe got me, I know it's hard to see because of the flash, uh, she got me this for my birthday, which is a moon phase from the day I was born. It has my birthstone at the bottom, and it glows in the dark. So, yeah. Tattoo, necklace. That's why I didn't do a birthday video, because um, that's all there was to it. Um, so, yeah. <clears throat> so, I'm going to show you guys my litha altar now. Um, so... I don't know if I'm going to do a full-on celebration tonight. I'm kind of tired. I stayed up till like 1.30 in the morning yesterday, or last night technically. Um, so like, I'll probably just, you know, do a short thing and then probably fall asleep. But <clears throat> some really cool stuff happened. So, <clears throat> take you guys around. Oh, small one. What you doing? Hi, hon. Yeah, this one's the little munchkin, so we call him Munchkin. What are you doing? Look at how short his little legs are, whereas the other ones are, like, really big. Like, they can jump and everything, but he's just, he's, he's a small little, little thing. This one is a very rambunctious one. No, oh, he's going underneath the altar. Okay. <clears throat> Alrighty, so. <sighs> Take it through everything. There's my god statue. He is his, uh, sunstone over here. Hi. Um, and then got a statue with her moonstone over there. There's the symbol for oak um, and the Celtic Oum. I had my gold candles out, my working candle, and then there is fire agate there, there, and there. And then my um, selenite spear and my selenite tower. There's a little mushroom there and a little mushroom there. My uh, phantom quartz, which I have on here, I think, every year. The elementals with their, like, I changed out the stones to raw stones. So this is my natural citrine. And, yes, that noise in the background is a kitten playing with some of my stuff in my lair. <laughs> they get into everything. Um, but, yes, this is my natural citrine, which I freaking adore. And then... Um, uh, double, technically triple terminated of my castle quartz for fire. The phantom quartz is, eh, come on, focus, at the point of spirit right now. Uh, green calcite and then aquamarine for earth and water. And then, ooh, don't want to crush the kitty. There's, uh, sunflowers there and there. There's my other natural citrine point here and then my lemon quartz double terminated point there. Uh, Labradorite on here as always. Pentacles over here. And this is the cool part. Kitty, kitty, what are you, what are you doing? You can't. Come here. You're adorable. I love you. Sorry, I get distracted by kittens easily. <laughs> but just look at him. He's so cute. He's the cutest one. I would keep him if I could, but I can't. Um... <clears throat> <laughs> so, oh, don't go under the bed. Let's let's not go there. Let's just go under here. That's fine. 
Um, so I brought out my uh, my last dish, the amber color dish. I figured it was appropriate for Litha. Um, I decided to go with this Alta Club this year instead of the orange one because I really did want the sense of oak on here as well as sun. I thought like this would be like really like represent the sun more. And we have sunflowers. Um, and so this would represent the earthier aspect. So like there is like brownish green on here that kind of reminds me of like oak leaves and oak trees. And there's also brighter colors in here, which kind of like, you know, you think of summer. So that's why I went with this altar cloth this year. And then around it, I have a ring of moonstone and garnet. And then there's my ring of lapis. And then I went down to the Grand River today, um, with my sister and her friend Madeline, and I found mushrooms! I'm so happy. I freaking adore mushrooms. They're adorable. And I also work with the fair ones, so you know, it's kind of perfect. So, um, there's like red and yellow ones. I think this one's like really cool, because like, let me focus. You can see all the stuff on it, like, it's freaking cool. Um, I have no idea if they're poisonous or not. I'm assuming not, because it's been over an hour since I've like held them and nothing's happened, so. But hey, if I die from mushroom poisoning, know that I was happy. <laughs> Freaking adore mushrooms. Um, so yeah, red and yellow. Uh, there's like some pale purple ones over there. This one's also really freaking cool. Look at, they're, they're adorable, I adore them. And then there's this thing, a colossal freaking mushroom that I found. Don't know what I'm going to do with all these. These ones I'll probably dry out and string up and, like, like use to decorate. Don't know what I'm going to do with this one. Also probably use to decorate or put it in my backyard and, like, hope that they'll grow more. I don't know. It's probably not how it works. But, um, <clears throat> yeah, I found that. So, that's my litha altar. Oh, yeah. And then um, there's a dried sunflower thing in here and a lapis uh thing there and that is my spell candle for tonight so yep that's about it there's a kitten over here where it shouldn't be i will be right back okay so yeah that's uh that's basically everything so i hope you guys enjoyed goodbye and blessed be